All right. So for this one, uh, I'll actually do uh, 5A. Um, I looked at 5B before, like, uh, with someone. Um, and I'm just getting, not, like, getting, like, uh, the result. Um, I was thinking I would get something from doing U plus V um, dotted with U minus V. And that ends up uh, leading to, like, uh, an equation. But then I end up getting... Uh, long story short that this ends up being zero so i'm not quite sure with that one um and then the one for like 5c uh you can actually like find that like online like a lot of places uh it's it's a little long um eh. so i would say i mean uh with great probability um i would bet that there would be something similar to 5a so basically something into which you can write down a generic U and a V and run through um, the definition of like whatever is being like asked and like get the property. So like for this one right here, we have something like show that basically um, it's supposed to be a V. So show that basically the dot product, you can like do like distribution. Right. And then the idea behind this is, okay, let's just take U and V, U, V, and W to be 2D vectors. And you can do the same thing with them being 3D vectors and so forth. Um, e and F. And we're going to literally do is we're going to run through the definition. So we're going to look at the left-hand side, and we're just going to write it down. So A, B, dot it with, okay, if I add these two vectors right here, I'll get um, C, E, well, C plus E, and D plus F. Right. And then now, if I dot product these two things, so there's actually no need for uh, the extra parentheses right here. So let me just cancel this out right here. If you take the dot product of these, then by definition, uh, what we end up getting is a times c plus e um, plus b times d plus f and we can break this up as a c uh, plus b c and then plus a e plus b f all right so again just did some distribution and then just like uh order them like a slightly different way because now this thing right here uh, is, uh, well, hold on. I think I duplicated something. This should be a uh, D. Because I was basically trying to group these two together. So this one and this one. And then uh, A, E, and B, F. So sorry about that. Uh, but you can see that this is A, B dotted with C, D. That's this side right here. And then this side right here is a B dotted with E F. And so then we have the result because here is U, here is V, and then here is U and here is W. And that's what we wanted to show. We wanted to show that if we took U dotted with V plus W, we wanted to show that it broke up into U dotted with V plus U dotted with W. Okay. And that's it for that one.